The oxygen sensor is fitted on the exhaust pipe before the catalytic converter. The sensor reacts to the oxygen content in the exhaust system. Closed loop means that the sensor monitors the oxygen content and the sensor signal is used to control air fuel mixture according to exhaust gas condition. The oxygen sensor has a heater element which heats the sensor to its optimum operating temperature of 600 degrees centigrade. The sensor is inoperative below 300 degrees centigrade. There are two types of oxygen sensors. Zirconia oxygen sensor and Titania oxygen sensor. The Zirconia oxygen sensor generates a small voltage depending on the exhaust gas condition. The normal voltage range is 0.2 to 0.8 volts. 0.2 volts indicates a lean mixture and a voltage of 0.8 volts indicates a richer mixture. The sensor can be checked by the fault code, current data, voltage measurement at terminal, waveform, and sensor simulation. The sensor has four terminals. Two of them are for sensor heaters and the others are for the sensors. The heater power is 12 volt from control relay. And the other wire is controlled by the ECM. Two terminals for the sensors consist of signal wire and ground. As for the current data measurement, check whether the lean and rich ratio of output values is about the 50% range. Also check the maximum and minimum voltage. It should be oscillated between 0 volt and 1 volt. Check if the engine becomes rich condition at sudden acceleration. If it becomes lean condition at sudden deceleration check the lean and rich ratio. Maximum and minimum values at the idle state or constant speed. If the signal from the signal wire is too rich or lean, check for an air leak or a clogging of the intake system, clogging of the fuel system, fuel pressure, poor ignition system, oxygen sensor heater, and so on. If the waveform is normal, but current data is abnormal, check the signal wire using the simulation function of high scan and check whether the ECM reads the sensor value correctly. The Titania oxygen sensor, unlike the Zirconia sensor, requires a voltage supply, as they do not generate their own voltage. The Titania oxygen sensor is used for changing the resistance depending on the air-fuel mixture. The ECM supplies 5 volts power and measures the voltage drop. The output voltage range of the Titania oxygen sensor is 0.5 to 4.5 volts. 0.5 volts indicates a rich mixture, and a voltage of 4.5 volts indicates a lean mixture. The sensor can be checked by the fault code, current data, voltage measurement at the terminals, waveform simulation, and so on. The sensor has four terminals, and two of them are for sensor heaters, and the rest are for the sensor. Heater power is 12 volt from the control relay, and the other wire is controlled by the ECM. 
The control signal is 10 Hz duty. The terminal for the sensors consists of signal wire and ground. As for the check using the current data, check whether the lean and rich ratio is close to 50% and maximum and minimum value oscillates between 0.5 and 4.5. As for the waveform check, check whether output frequency is 1 Hz at 3000 RPM after engine warm-up. And check the lean and rich ratio of the output values and maximum and minimum values. When the signal wire waveform becomes too rich or lean, check for an air leak or clogging of the intake system clogging of the fuel system, fuel pressure, poor ignition system, oxygen sensor heater, and so on. As for the oxygen sensor heater check, check the duty signal from the heater control valve. If waveform is normal but current data is abnormal, Check the signal wire using the simulation function of high scan. And also check whether the ECM reads the sensor values correctly.